is the trans people <laughs> being all, all like up and roar for this? For real. Women's tech career conference. Naturally, <laughs> what happened in a situation like this in a society where we can't even define what a man is or what a woman is or what nine non-binary or gender fluid or anything like that men started to uh to register for the event as non-binary and they're showing up and taking these spots from women at these events and applying for jobs because guess what they're non-binary motherfuckers and uh they could they could be there if they want to which is w the most 2023 thing ever in the world w men career conference for females in tech was taken over by male attendees <laughs> these dudes just random dudes <laughs> looking for jobs so he could funny. pass as a woman a lesbian that's good rachel that's so meadow's like yeah. younger cousin he could i could see it, it. <laughs> they were there just purely for the career fair social media clip <laughs> yes <accurate. laughs> they didn't want any of us they weren't trying to fuck us they were just trying to get jobs just trying to get some jobs Still that the Grace Hopper, the world's largest gathering of women technologists, show men standing in line to meet with recruiters. This is a space <laughs> for women in tech. Hold on. Can we just back up real quick? Look at these dudes in fucking cargo shorts. <laughs> I don't know. what What's a worse state that these dudes are showing up in this women's place or they're showing up looking like they just rolled out of bed? They, they don't, don't even have, care. Yeah, they don't even, like, <laughs> and they're going to get the jobs. This is one of those few limited resources that isn't for you it's for us some of the meal <laughs> oh 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 no you know what i'm sorry i don't give a fuck yeah. i have zero fucks to give at all there are so many other things that have been going on over the past two years that are so much bigger oh your tech job oh fuck you for real fuck you bitch i don't give a fuck about a tech job being taken away Fuck off. You know what? Th these guys are probably better engineers than you are anyway. All right. And if not, you if, if not, then you wouldn't need this fucking women's only. All right. Mm -hmm. You'd be good enough to get the job anyway. All right. What about the freaking uh, women's sports being taken over or women's restrooms or freaking kids? Uh, any anything to do with the kids in school? They all vote shit, for that. Being, being raped in fucking uh, a women's bathroom because that's happening and they're fucking hiding that shit. Where's you, where are you speaking out about that? I don't They're see in support it. of it. Fuck They're you, tech. bitch. You fucking bitch about this. Honestly, <laughs> this pisses me off. I don't give a fuck. It's That's hilarious, man. It's hilarious. So th That's sad. But it's interesting <laughs> that the large majority of the people that actually ended up in the event had name tags with he, him. And, and that's what he's upset about. <laughs> that's oh, gotcha. He thought that was a yeah. gotcha. No, they're probably women. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I have no searchable history of identifying as non-binary. Searchable? What does that mean? They're nobodies. It, so, so they're going but through they're searching social their social media, right? So, so you're going through and searching, making sure that they they felt this way. Who the, Maybe like, they were in the again? closet? Maybe they were hiding the whole time right. until today. Right, they they chose. Maybe they this. weren't in a comfortable space to truly be themselves. You fucking bigot. So this is a a mental thing, right? Yeah, this is a, absolutely. A, this, this has to do with like IQ and what how you can handle being in the tech career, right? And I don't think that that is a physical thing at all. Like I think there's really um, incredibly smart human beings on both sides. Yes, there's. Uh, genius women and genius men. So it got so bad that bad that the conference needed to uh, make an address on stage. <laughs> right? oh, goody, let's hear this. All right. So this was this is what they said on stage. I was also I'd also like to point out at this women conference, who is on stage? Yesterday, it became clear that there are a far greater number of cisgender men attending the meeting to say. Simply put, some of you lied about your gender identity when you registered. Big it. And I can't understand him. Stats. What's that? I can't understand him. It's too echoey. He said, no, he's just lying. I do, I do, I did catch that he was saying there's a lot of cisgendered men here. Again, yeah. how the yeah. fuck does he know this? Stacks of resumes. You're passing out. You did so because you thought that you could come here and take space to try to get a job. Wow. So he said you, you passed out resumes because you thought you could come here and get a job. He's lecturing these guys.
Right. He's, he hates he's lecturing these thems. Yeah, he Sorry, hates I, them. I just want to be inclusive. You're right, though. We need male allies. We need men who want to celebrate women, who want to work with and for women. So okay, so he made this Fuck power you. powerful that, statement. That's what I would scream that before anyone started. <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 how I just said it right there, you would have heard it in the crowd. Just, I would have been standing there by myself, just like, fuck you. I would be the one throwing tomatoes. He's up here man mansplaining to these women. He is. <laughs> well, uh, technically, he's talking to the men there. Right. So, right. But they're all women. That's right. These are, well, are non-binary women. Watch the response here after he made his powerful statement. We need men who are allies. Right. And he, by the way, he says we, uh, assuming that he he's a woman. Is a woman <laughs> he doesn't speak for me. He can go fuck himself. He does. Here we go. Unfortunately, some of you took discounted academic tickets from women in Oh, this is where the shame comes oh, in. Oh, oh, boo hoo. Huh? What about the, the different Olympic teams that have the, the swimming team? Some of you are taking energy slots right now. All the splittering is going on. We're going to need that. Some of you are standing in line to talk to recruiters instead of letting them speak. All of those are limited resources to which you have no right. <laughs> Where's the where is the trans people being all, all like up and roar for this? For real. I think this is this goes back to this is what you asked for. This is exactly what you asked for. Facts. You know? Like I here we didn't go. Ask for this. Thank you very much. Well, you don't work for You're not Bungie. a liberal tech guy. <laughs> here we go. Or woman. And here comes the power. Yeah, you can tell he has some issues. So let me be perfectly clear. I'll kill oh, you. Stop. Please be perfectly clear. Right now. <laughs> what are you going to do about it? <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> right. No means no. <laughs> <laughs> stop it, please. Please stop. Stop it. It's like... <laughs> But, but it's a belief system. Anyone yeah. could just say anything and you have to believe it or you're a bigot. So is he a bigot or is he standing up for like what we've been fighting yeah. for for a long time? I agree with him on a lower level. Snackle Mochi on Twitter I followed up this tweet with a very simple question. It was just saying, beyond calling them out, what other steps are you taking to ensure that women and, no and non-binary people actually get the resources during this during the celebration this year? Uh, they are they are still all over the career fair. They, I mean, you mean like men uh, taking up huge chunks of lines. And this, their response was, thank you for asking. Our first step towards creating a plan for change is to listen. <laughs> like, that doesn't do jack shit. What does that shit. mean? Yeah, right. And we're in the process of developing a collaborative avenue for GHC attendees to share more so we can do just that. We're like... So make it co-ed? That, that, mean, that means nothing. If, if women are pissed about this, they absolutely <laughs> should be pissed about this because this yes. has been going on. And you like now that it affects you, yes. you're interested, right? Yep. But you, you gotta get you can't you gotta get off the sidelines and be like, oh, you know, I was just thinking it was gonna work itself out. No, it ain't gonna is, work itself this out. This is two armies that are like have been warring and they're yeah. like looking at her about to charge each other, and like some some soy boy dude comes in the middle and be like, you need to stop. Like, <laughs> who the fuck are you, dude? Bro, trolls are changing the world. Like, if these dudes, they all clearly showed up in line, like, to troll, see if they could actually do it. That type of shit is what's going to make it all fall apart. Hey, if you enjoyed that clip, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Would greatly appreciate that. So you can find more clips on the channel. And, of course, come join us live Monday through Friday at 11 a.m. Central Time for our live Side Scrollers podcast. We would love to see you there.